I was glad that Rafi also mentioned our friends from Brazil who made an extraordinary impact on this conference throughout numbers of panels and through an incredible meeting of folks from the global south to look at race and economics and global drug policy. It's work that will continue. If they build walls, we build bridges. And one of the people who was um, so extraordinary was a brother named Wagner Morea Campos. He's here with us. He's got to make a flight. And so we thank you for pushing it to the limit. Joining him is our senior manager of international policy, Hannah Hetzer, who speaks about 95 languages and puts us all to shame. But Hannah and, and uh, Wagner, would you please come to the stage? And I think we need mic one turned on. Boa noite a todas e todas. Foram três dias de ricos debates envolvendo o contexto de diversos países. Good evening, everyone. The last three days have been full of rich debate from, with people from around the world. Mas o meu principal desafio aqui ainda é denunciar o genocídio contra o povo negro que vem acontecendo no Brasil. O genocídio responsável pelo assassinato de 60 mil pessoas por ano. But our aim, main aim in coming here was to denounce the genocide of black Brazilians, a genocide that is responsible for the deaths of 60,000 people a year. A guerra às drogas é parte da justificativa que a supremacia branca utiliza para cometer o genocídio nas nossas comunidades negras e continuar nos matando quando nós estamos encarcerados. Yes. Uh, the war on drugs is a big part of the justification used in white supremacy and, um, gen and the genocide against black Brazilians and incarcerating us and then killing us when we're inside the prisons. Um terço da população carcerária no Brasil está encarcerada por tráfico de pequenas quantidades de drogas. A third of the prison population in Brazil is there for trafficking of small quantities of drugs. Agora em outubro, com, com, contemplamos 25 anos da chacina do Carandiru, onde a polícia militar matou 111 pessoas encarceradas. This month marks the 25th anniversary of the biggest massacre in a Brazilian prison, where 111 people were killed behind bars. Em 1 de janeiro de 2017, num motim na penitenciária de Pedrinhas, 54 pessoas morreram no primeiro dia de 2017. In the first day of January of 2016, 56 people were killed in a prison in Brazil. O que eu quero dizer com isso é que a guerra às drogas, ela continua nos matando, tanto nas comunidades quanto dentro do sistema penitenciário. So what I'm saying with this is that the war on drugs not only kills us in the streets, it kills us behind bars. Nós necessitamos legalizar o uso e a comercialização de drogas. Este vai ser um passo muito importante para diminuir o genocídio que o povo negro vem sofrendo no Brasil. We need to decriminalize and legalize the consumption and sale of drugs to end the war, to end the genocide of black Brazilians. E eu saio daqui com a certeza de que esses três dias de debates contribuem muito no sentido da descriminalização do uso de drogas e na redução do genocídio e dos assassinatos do povo negro no Brasil. Obrigado. Thank you. I am certain that these three days of this conference has helped push us to fight for the end of the war on drugs and the end of the genocide of black Brazilians. Thank you. Thank you.